Hi guys, welcome to another video. I am so sorry. I know I did not post in the last week because I had a lot of things going on in my life and um, hopefully from now on it's going to be as regular as it was before every Sunday. So in this video, it's something interesting and it's something different because everybody's doing the 10 years challenge. I did post on my Instagram uh, a picture of how I looked in 2009 and how I look recent and uh, i thought of doing a video in which i show you guys embarrassing pictures of mine and i find them embarrassing you guys might not find them embarrassing you guys might find them embarrassing so anyway the point of the video i'll tell you in the end all right so let's get started with the video with the embarrassing pictures so i'm gonna start with pictures that i have from um this is like a picture which I have from a very old time and then the pictures that I have are from 2008 onwards and uh, hopefully you will be seeing them on the screen somewhere or the full screen and then I'll bring them in the corner and then I will be explaining each and everything and we'll be reacting to them. So yeah, let me show you how embarrassing I used to look in my eyes. The first picture is the most embarrassing picture in the entire video. I am so embarrassed to show this but I think it's important you guys see it that I used to look like that as well. So here's the first picture. It's so frigging Harry Potter-ish but Harry Potter looks much nicer of course. Look at my hair, look at... oh my god. <laughs> this is embarrassing. I, I now laugh at it and I actually kept it because I'm like I want to see this and I want to laugh at it every single time I look at it. This is embarrassing. This is the worst you can look. Just forget it. Next picture. This is a picture from 2008. This is when I had started off or I was in the middle of O-levels. And this is when I was very interested in television and a lot of... And I was highly interested in music and all that and I still am. So yeah, that was my room, very dirty, very old fashionistic. <laughs> so yeah, that's that's the second picture. But I like the way my hair was. It was very natural because I never used to dye them or anything. I recently started dyeing my hair like the past 4 years or so. Not before that. So yeah. This is how it looked. I had a television in my room, I got rid of the television because it was a waste of time for me to be honest because I would just sit and change channel. There was change channels and there was nothing exactly productive so I got rid of it and now I watch everything on my phone or laptop just like you guys do. So yeah, that's picture number two. I kind of like this picture. Picture number three. This is also from 2000 and oh no this is from 2009. Huh. This is 2009. This is a picture where my eyebrows are absolutely, oh my god. But my hair is nice. I do like my hair. This is actually um, in Karachi. We had our O-level last year. We were graduating that year and we went to, we went to this club. I forgot the club's name. I'll just put it down in the text. We went to the club with the whole class and we had a picnic there, we had lunch there, we had games there. I forgot the name, bloody, it's so, so famous. Okay, forget it. So yeah, my eyebrows, I have dark circles here, highly dark, darkened dark circles. So I'm not liking this. I don't like this picture, but the only reason I've kept it because my hair is nice. I had to, I used to have that long hair and I intend to keep it mid-length like I don't like very long. I don't like very very long but I like mid-length hair 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 this is from 2009 this is another picture which I posted on Instagram as well if you guys want to follow me there sure go ahead I usually post a lot of pictures there but I used to be regular but again I'm not gonna promise to be regular because shit happens right so whenever I can post I'll just post it and you can see the other snippets of my life as they're going on so this is a picture i really really like why the only reason i like it because because of the shalwarka color <laughs> can you imagine i actually like it because of the shalwarka color the purple color and i also like it because of the headphones do you guys remember like 10 years ago we had these headphones that fit into your ear and they look kind of dope 
you know, and then you have the, the, the wire and then you have your phone or your MP3 player. I think I was with an MP3 player over here and this is actually my aunt's place. This is her wallpaper thing going on. And uh, yeah, I love those. I used to love those, but now I can't wear them because as I'm growing older, I like things to be more, you know, tech savvy, things to be more easy to use, not burdening on the ear. So no, okay. Next picture. This is from 2016. Yes, it's a big jump and a big, you know, like I eloped from 2009 to 16. It's because to, between 2009 and 16, I hardly, I seldom took pictures. I, I really did not take that many pictures. And even if I did, I don't have them. So yeah, there was a big transition. This picture is interesting because this is the first time I applied makeup entirely on my face. On my own I learned the technique from my aunt and then I went we went to Hyderabad and we had one of my very good friends wedding there so this is the first time I did my whole face even though I was very chubby from the face but um, I find this picture okay okay not bad I still don't like it if I compare it to right now this is another picture from 2016 which is like December ish 2016 this is uh, for the first time when I um, got my you know hair curled and they looked really nice i got a balayage etc etc i like this picture but my eyebrows are very bad i don't like that what the hell so yeah i was very simple i still am very simplistic in the way i approach things but um my taste has evolved and i like the way it has evolved this is not that good so curls yes i want to get a curler there's another thing that i want to get Get a curler and curl my hair and then you know i want to try those loose and then tight and then beach curls so yeah i like this picture this is another picture from 2017 which is a recent one it's like february january february 2017 it's one of my o-level classmates wedding uh, we went to her wedding so i really love this picture because this is when i did proper proper dhanka makeup which looks dhanka and, and everything dhanka so I like <laughs> so I really like this picture and I liked my hair in it I left the hairstyle to be very natural I just straightened them like quarter from top and then left the rest naturally so they were naturally wavy so yeah I like this picture this is a picture from 2017 mid 2017 when my friend was getting married this is um, when I completely straightened my hair and this is how I used to look. I think I was still a bit chubby from the face, but my makeup was very minimalistic, like hardly you can see it. But now uh, I do makeup that is visible. So good job, Taiba. Good job. And this is the latest picture, I believe. Yes, this is 2018. This is what I uploaded on Instagram. This is the latest picture, latest how I look and no exactly no 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 this is how i look latest <laughs> okay i hope you guys uh looked at all the embarrassing picture for me they're not that embarrassing but if i go very very you know behind in my early childhood i hated all my pictures and i still do you know uh, if i can get hold of any of my childhood picture which i like i will show you guys but uh i don't like any one of them so going back to this particular picture the harry potter spectacles picture uh this is a picture i absolutely hate but let me tell you this because i'm the reason now the reason for this particular video is not just something you know not like that there's a reason why i made this video i want you guys all those girls and boys out there who are watching my videos and who are very young right now and you guys have not become independent in the sense of your financial needs or your living or your lifestyle there are many times somebody will tell you that you look ugly or your nose is like an elephant or I don't know, you feel like you're absolutely ugly. Let me tell you this, no matter what, no matter what, you're not ugly. You're beautiful, okay? We all are beautiful. It's just that it takes people time to groom themselves, to look better, to uh, know their body really well, to know what is best for them, what looks great on them. What I would advise is, Great, I'm an advisor now. What I was what I would advise is that love yourself first, and then, then, and then only would you love others. Okay, if you don't love yourself, you're not gonna love others. 
you gotta accept yourself you gotta be the who person you who you are and i'm very sure all of you watching there are beautiful people except a few evil people i don't know who they are but there are evil people everywhere if you don't love yourself you cannot love other people you need to know who you are within time you will transition you will see changes in yourself you will better you will uh, become the great person that you will be one day okay that the, the world will remember at you as somebody who spread positivity and love and i think in this day and age all we need is love and respect for each other uh, whether we like it or not right so if i can look like this okay when i was younger and i can transition into somebody who looks a bit, a bit much much better I think you guys will do a much better job if you start knowing yourselves and then understanding your body and what you are, how you think, who you are. And I think that's that's all the difference that it makes. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys like the video, please like it, share it. You can subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on Instagram. I usually post there on and off, on and off, most regularly over there. You can see my unedited life over there and I share snippets of my life on Instagram. So yeah, I hope to see you guys in the next week. Till then, love yourself and you all are beautiful and bye-bye.